YouTube. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. Yes, we back here with another video. Now, as you can see by the thumbnail and the title, I, this is the bill I've been talking about. This bill is a glitched 6 7 bill with max wingspan, and he get all the shooting. All the finishing, all the playmaking, and especially the best part about this build is the defense. The defense is the best part about this build because I'm a defender and I like to have a tall playmaking defender that can do everything. Now, to me, this is the build that can do everything in this game. Now, the video might be a little long, but as you can see, watch the way I tweak this build. Now, I tweaked it to my preference because, you know, I'm playing with other people. I'm going to be running, like, really the two guard, but this build can run point guard, too, in the wreck. Now, in the pro-am, this ain't the build for pro-am. You got to have specific builds for pro-am, but, like, in the wreck in part, you can do whatever you want with this build. Now, the only thing I would try to tweak with this build is raised is pass accuracy a little more like if you want a lot of defensive badges but still want more playmaking you can tweak that on this build if you've been for real but the way to make this build is you have to switch go into your settings and switch your um build from imperial to metric system now everybody know the metric system gives you more badge points it's done that this it didn't it, it did it in 2k 21 nation and it does it in this one too now, as you can see off the rip, I get Hall of Fame Interceptor, Clamps, Pig Dodger, Pickpocket, Hall of Fame Menace. Like, come on now. Like, what bad, Like, what player wouldn't you want to be like this? And he can dribble and dunk? Come on now. This is a dream build. And he get, and he, I mean, his speed goes up to like a 90 if you get gym right with it. I got to get gym right on this player. But right now, I got this build to a 93 overall. I'll show you some um, clips. And I'll show you some gameplay of the build later on in the future. But well, really, it might be my next video. I might show some gameplay of this build. Because, man, I'm having fun with this build. I ain't going to lie. I was killing in the wreck yesterday. Like, yesterday, we beat a team by 70. We was killing them, boys. It was crazy, too. I ain't going to lie. But this build was averaging, like, really five steals a game. If you're a defender, you can really average a good five to six steals on this build. Easy easy and really you could average more if the team throw the ball right i mean if the other team throws the ball directly towards you that's how it's gonna be majority of the time now as you can see right now my badge layout is 12 19 26 and i was trying to tweak the build to 30 because i was messing around in this build i messed around with this build for maybe i say about 30 to 40 minutes because i tried to get this build perfect to the way i wanted it now this build, I was trying to make him to see if like, he could get different badges or I could like tweak the settings a little bit to give him like more badges, but this is the best I could come up with. Now, as you can see, I was still trying to tweak a few things to give him just a little bit more stamina, maybe a little bit more offensive rebound, defensive rebound, maybe a little bit more blocks. Check this out. I think I was trying to give him just a little bit more playmaking. That's what I think I was trying to do in this game. I can't be sure. I'm not sure, but we'll see because I recorded this maybe, I would say, a week ago. Yeah, I think I recorded this like a week ago, but as you can see, I was trying to raise his stats up to be like killer because I was trying to make this build perfect. I was trying to make this my one and only well, final point guard build because I'm not trying to make a lot of point guard builds this shit like I did in the past. Now, as you can see, you get 19 shooting. And in reality, you can really tone that down. Now, you see, I keep going back to um, the regular player builder. Now, the height for this build is 1.99 kilometers. Now, if you, can, if you go back in the beginning of the gameplay, you'll see from 1.98 to 1.99, the player raises an inch, but the stats stay the same. That's why I say this build is a glitched 6'7". In reality, he's 6'7", but on the car, he say 6'6". Six, six. I don't know why, but hey, man, I love it. I love the build, man. I'm, I, I love this build, man. I ain't going to lie to you. This is my favorite build I made in a minute. Cause this really like the power forward from um 2k 21 next gen in my eyes because this is the what i would give him 
this is like this is really the badge count or very similar to my badge count last year because last year my badge count was like eight finishing which i get four more finishing this year 16 shooting i got like 16 to 19 yeah i think i got like 16 shooting my power forward last year and i get three more this year I get like I got like two, I know for a fact I got 22 playmaking last year and I get four more playmaking badges this year and I get 30 defense like my other build got 30 defense and pickpocket work this year that's the best thing about this game man that's the best thing about this game pickpocket works the last 2k pickpocket work I would say was 19 because 20 people would say it would work, but 20, you really couldn't stop it. But this game, it really works. Like, that's the best thing I like about this game. The defensive badges work. So the more defense you have, the more you can tell that the badges work. I like it. This is what I've been waiting on. Like, that's the best thing. Because, boy, in a wreck, you can tell if they suck or not. You go in that wreck and you suck. And they got Hall of Fame pickpocket. Oh, it's going to show. Yeah, you get graded out every time. Every time. And it ain't no crazy shots you hitting. You not hitting none of that stuff you was hitting in 2K21 Nation if you played. And the reason I say if you played, because a lot of people did not play 2K21 Nation. Now, I played Nation. I had the PS5. I was going to play Nation. I was not going to no PS4. And all my friends was playing Nation. So, hey, man, that's the reason I was playing it. But if you played that game, you, you could tell it was no defense. They was just pushing off of you. Everybody was hitting fluke stuff, contact dunks. Y'all know how the game went. I ain't got to explain all that. But as you can see, the playmaking best. I wish I could get Hall of Fame quick first step on this build. But you have to be a short player to get Hall of Fame quick first step. Now will I make now will I ever make a short player again? I don't know. I really don't like to, but because it's really not my type of game anymore. Night like back in 2K16 and 17, I would play with a short point guard, but now, nah, man, I had to stop that because, bro, I used to get bullied out there by them six sevens. Once you used to see them six sevens back in the day, it's like, nah, I ain't never making no short point guard again, and I haven't either. But and that's why I like this build because he's tall, can get everything, can do everything, really. Only thing he's probably not that good at is finishing, but you really don't need to finish. You can finish a little bit on this build, but that's all you really need. Because, hey, man, like I said, man, this build, this build is where it's at. You should be able to shoot with a 83 ball in this game. I'm greening with the 83 ball in this game consistently. Now, the only thing I have a problem with in this game is when you shoot the ball, you still get the early and late goods. That's the only thing I don't like about this game right now. But other than that, this game lit. Like, right now, I think I'm trying to tweak the stats to give myself more playmaking because, you know, you always need the playmaking. You need the extra playmaking. Well, to me, my style of play, I need all the playmaking I can get, even if I have to sacrifice. So you see right now, I'm trying to sacrifice some of the finishing to go on the defense, I think. Or well, I'm really trying to get myself a little bit more playmaking, like I said previous, a few seconds ago. Like, I'm still trying to tweak the stats to make the perfect build. Now, I think I raised my... I'm not sure what I was trying to do. I think I was trying to raise my drive and dunk so I could get certain contact dunk packages or raise... Oh, I know what I was doing. I was trying to get my posterizer on gold. But then I realized I don't need post rise on gold. It's good on silver. Now all I got to do is really for my finishing is just try to unlock. I just got to try to unlock contact dunks or buy some um, be, um buy some dunk styles in this game. Because right now my dunk styles are not that good. They are not that good. All I had, like the only dunk, I, only dunk package I have equipped right now on that two-way playmaker is Lucas Dunk Package. Now, only reason I ain't been buying it because I've been trying to grind for level 40. Right now, I am a level 22. Now, when this gameplay is posted, I might be a 23. I'm not sure, but I might not. I might still be a 22. I'm trying to hit on um, level 44 times. I just want to see what the reward is gonna be. No, they said we get new mascots this year. They said we get five new ones. 
we get five new ones. We get each, we get a mascot for each affiliation, which is cool. And we get a skeleton mascot, which whatever that is. Now, the only thing I hope is the prices on the mascots not too high. Cause you know, every year they make that, they make that mascot price. How that thing, 300K a mask, that's crazy. Like, like who they be trying to finesse like that? But anyway, as you can see, I was trying, well, I think this is the final, I think this is the final build. I think I was satisfied after this. He gets 12 finishing, 19 shooting, 27 playmaking, and 30 defense. Y'all see all them Hall of Fame defensive badges. Y'all, yeah, hey, hey, man, if you a defender, this build go crazy. If you, if you don't believe me, try it out. Try it out, boy. I'm telling you. This build go crazy in the wreck, man. It ain't no, it ain't no game. It is not no game, bro. Like this thing is woo. Build different. It's different. Now as you can see, for him, I wanted to be different. I put on extreme clamps and I gave him a playmaking takeover. Now the reason I gave him a playmaking takeover is because I just wanted to be different. Even though when I activate double takeover on him, I'm gonna um give him the badge. Dang, man. Yeah, I think what play, I think I gave him team ratings. Yeah, I think I gave him team ratings boost. But yeah, man, this was my final build. No, this is my version of a point guard build. This is gonna be my main point guard. For any video you see, this is going to be that build, that 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 demon. This that demon right here, boy. I'm telling you, man. I'm, I'm telling you, man. You need to create this build. Give it a try. But if not, go in the play, go in the um my player builder and test it out. You see, the build came out as a two-way playmaker. Now I don't care who they compare him to. I don't really care about all of that because you know they can compare you to different people, but you don't got to play like them. Like me, I just do me. Like, look for the finishing. I gave him silver post rods. I think I tried to give him. Gold limitless takeoff, but I can only go silver at that moment. But hey, man, it was all right. I was trying to, I was trying to, well, the finishing really don't matter to me. It really don't matter to me. Even though I do dunk a lot, it really don't matter to me. Now, for the shooting, I gave him silver high zone hunter, silver rhythm shooter, Hall of Fame sniper. Now, I think I changed the Hall of Fame sniper or something else to give him more shooting badges. I gave him gold lucky sevens and gold, I mean, silver green machine and silver lucky sevens, my bad. And I gave him bronze dead eye not for the playmaking. I gave him gold quick first step, um, silver unpluckable, bronze bell light. They say bronze bell light works good this year. Gold hyperdrive, gold quick chain, silver anchor breaker, and bronze, no, and silver bullet passing. Now I was trying to figure out a way to give him dimer Plus handles for days, but I had to tweak some. I had to put my um diamond of bronze. But this is not my official. This is not my official bags layout. I'll do an official bags layout later on into the year too. And I gave him gold quick. No, I mean gold handles for days. You need handles for days as a playmaker in this game. You need handles for days, boy. I'm telling you. And you really gotta learn how to count if you want this build you really got to learn how to dribble on this build because you will get ripped easily on this build you will get ripped easily so you really gonna have to learn now you know for the deepest you know you had to get up with hall of fame clamps hall of fame interceptor give them silver rebound chaser silver intimidator hall of fame pickpocket which is the best part about this build right here and I was trying to give him Hall of Fame minutes, but I was trying to tweak it. But I don't think I could give him Hall of Fame minutes at this point. So I just gave him Silver Run Protector. And yeah, man, that's really the end of this build. I'm telling you, if you want a playmaking defender build that can do everything, this is the build for you. All you got to do is just learn how to dribble on this build, man. Yeah, man, that's really it for me, man. Like I said, man, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And I'm out. Peace.